called the hot potato drill, the hot potato drill. The way you get into the hot potato is you do a normal swing and you catch right here. Now you can actually use this as a normal exercise as well. And then catch. And catch. But the hot potato, you start with it in one hand. And then you transfer it to this hand. Looks easy, right? And then boom, boom, boom. And you try to get like just a little bit of air. Notice that I'm forced to kind of bend and dip and my obliques are contracting pretty hard. And it looks pretty easy, but let's do it. <laughs> for one minute. And this is fresh. Now imagine doing it as a set of side swings. It'd be pretty breathless, okay? So everyone, swing into the hot potato drill. Swing against the hand. On my count. Make, oh, by the way, when you swing, make sure that the handle is facing this way. Okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Hot potato. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. Right. Then boom, 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 boom. That's 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Keep it going. Not easy. You want to get a distinct. If you're in, if your main hand on it, if you're not forced to get the elbow into the side, it's probably to the left. 15 seconds. It's probably to the left. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, and go that. You can really feel it, even with the lighter belt. And notice how it really robs your, your wind. The reason it's robbing your wind is your <coughs> <coughs> so your constant contraction. But it's really good to teach people how to contract and breathe, you know, like taking a punt, maybe six, but you still got to take a little sniff of air. So it's really good for fighter. It's really good for anyone that takes impact.